Yeah. Feeding time. Feed me more. Yo, welcome to Feeding Time here on Feed Me More TV. I am the big guy, Ryback. Feed me if you need me. Got my Starbucks coffee. Need you guys to bear with me here, guys. Bear with me. I had my, my back stem cell procedure yesterday, so I'm a little, uh, maybe a lot sore uh, from the epidural. And uh, I was able to shower and I don't take they, I don't take the pain medication. I don't even get it from them. And uh, it's uh, definitely though the, the back procedure of that between that and the shoulder is always a day or two, and it's always from the epidural. It's not from the actual injecting. And don't get me wrong; like they, they're injecting huge needles into my disc, but I'm I'm out for that, and that doesn't honestly doesn't hurt. Like as far as uh, I don't have. I think there's a little inflammation, obviously, from, but I'm not in a lot of pain. The tailbone area, though, the coccyx, coccyx, the coccyx bone, the coccyx bone, all that, that just, it, it hurts. It hurts bad. But Starbucks has, I saw that they have the impossible breakfast sandwiches. You know what? I need to go try this. So I have my black coffee. I got two of these bad boys right here for you guys. These are the Starbucks Impossible Impossible Breakfast Sandwiches. It has this, um, it's not a croissant. It's the, it's not a bun either. What are these called, guys? I should know this. Stupid! Can't get too excited. But we got the egg, the impossible sausage. I think it's in sausage with melted cheese. And um, on this nice, and I know the name of it. I can't think of it. Say on it, impossible sausage warmed. Go fluff yourself, big guy. I ain't cuss. All right, let's dive in. People are mad. Mm. It's my bite marks. This is good. I'm getting concerned with how good these are getting. If you give this just any regular Tom, Dick, or Harry out there, they're not going to know. They're not going to know. I really should get paid for doing this stuff from these companies. I have to remember, WWE, they do stuff with the different food companies. This was after I already trademarked Feed Me More. And they wanted me, it was to do, have you ever seen that some of the superstars would do the commercials? They don't get paid shit for that stuff. If it is, it's very, very small. And they wanted to do something with the Feed Me More. And WWE was getting all the money. And they were just going to throw like a small, it would have been beyond tiny rather than just work where people work out deals with companies like that you, you make a decent amount of money but as soon as i saw that i go uh -uh, nope i ain't tying that onto that with that i'd rather not get paid because it was so it was just so people are aware of how that stuff works it's uh it's one of those deals wwe will get a, a check for like five hundred thousand or three hundred thousand you'll get like twenty five hundred bucks maybe no, thank you. Mm. 
This is good. Mm. I need more information, guys. This feed me if you need me shirt. I'm digging it. Feed me if you need me. Big daddy. Big daddy. Big guy. <laughs> ah. Vehicle. Keep going. Thought they were gonna park right next to me. I'm out. There's no cars or cars parked next to a bank. But I don't think the bank is open right now because nobody's coming in and out of the bank. They haven't the whole time. But I thought that there's nothing else to park over here for, other than if they wanted to do a food review too, which I'm fucking find another. Damn it, I cost. Ah! Fuck! I just can't not cuss when I have. If I know I'm doing on the freedom of my own show, put me in a wrestling ring and tell me no cussing. I, I'm, all, I'm good all day. Put a little food in my mouth though, and I'm a cussing machine. Mask are mandatory now starting in Vegas. By the time this comes out, I'll be wearing a mask. But I don't know how long that's going to go on for. I'm not really overly, I don't go either way with anything. Like as far as, you know, people will be like, oh, I'm not wearing a mask. It's like if I have to wear a mask to go grocery shopping, cool. Well, I'm not going to not put a mask on. We've seen it just looks see see people trying to stop me from going into the store and then me beating the shit out of everybody and then like go to jail it's not like it's not gonna be like one of those videos where like the Pearson gets thrown down it's like I'm gonna beat the shit out of everyone because you're trying to touch me but I'd be the asshole for trying to go in without a mask I'm not doing that I'll just order from Instacart but uh where I'm getting at is people are mad I just think everyone's fed up with everything so they get angry, like child, like very childish angry, and rebel. There's a lot of bullshit going on though with a lot of other things. So, but I'm okay with it. I don't like having to wear a mask in the gym. I think honestly, think that's really, 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 really sucks. But I have my gym at home too, so I don't have to go in there and put up with it. But like, what if I want to see you know some hot chicks? throwing a pair of shades in there, they won't even know. I think a dream come true. That's not a bad idea, actually. I might have to do that. Nah, but it'll be fine. I'm not too worried about it. Not too worried. I've worked so much anyways, I'm not out and about doing things. But I do wonder, like, at the pools, the hotels, the clubs, like, people aren't gonna, like, hot chicks out there, dudes, everyone's gonna be in masks. You can't do that and, like, drink and stuff. It's really odd. I don't know. I don't know how. But we just have to see. Just wait and see. This is this is too good. I'm telling you. gonna grow like a dick out of my forehead or something and wake up like what's the dick doing out of my forehead oh it was that impossible sandwich I had from Starbucks stupid it is so good this is my pump plex city ultra premium pump formula also with my 10 count creatine with 10 different creatines and glycer pump to keep me fucking jacked. Okay, they didn't give me a bag to put this in. Done. So, guys, this is uh, the Starbucks Impossible Impossible Sausage sand, Breakfast Sandwich.
I want you guys to go try this yourself. My loser food tray. Put that over here. This was, I had the Burger King Impossible Breakfast Sandwich. I honestly would like to put those head to head in a mukbang and see. I might have to do it in that Dunkin' Donuts too. Maybe go get theirs and do a triple threat mukbang of impossible turkey sandwiches. I can't tell the difference though, guys, on this. That tastes like legit turkey. And I've, we, like, I've, the impossible burgers and stuff, you can tell a different difference in the taste. Even though like the Carl's Jr. one, fantastic sandwich. The Burger King, it's fantastic. I, and I, I love, I love, the, I love meat. Like, and I, but I do this vegetarian six days a week because I know how much healthier it is. And I sparingly put in some, some meat on Sunday, one or two meals and, uh, or a grass fed steak on the day in one video, whatever. But, um, this is five stars the the bun that the, it's not a bun would someone someone in the jeffrey leave it in the comments and tell me how stupid i am okay and you bitch karen you go ahead and chime in on it and, and yeah 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 yes um that had like a buttery toasted top um and it was juicy and it was still and it was hot but it wasn't too hot that was just it was an incredible meal all the way around. Like, I'm really, really happy. Like I forgot my back hurt for 10 minutes until I did that scream where I heard it a little bit. But other than that, I didn't think about it. And I'm starting to think about it. Now it's starting to hurt again. Um, That's two thumbs up, guys. Five stars. I want you to try for yourself so you know that the big guy Ryback does not bullshit you. I don't need to bullshit you. I don't have a deal with Starbucks. I don't have a deal with Burger King. If they would love to have a deal with me, they can contact me at the website, feed me the big guy, feed me more.com. We can work a deal out. Ty, feed me more to that. Like, it, I always had a conflict too. Like, feed me more. I never wanted to tie it to junk food as much. But if it's something with a better, higher purpose, like the Impossible Burger, I, I think it's a good fit. I think it's going to happen. It's, gonna, it's definitely going to happen at some point being the owner of Feed Me More has to happen makes sense and that morally that was always it's like the people that like do the deals with like Sprite and like they get the, what are you really I get it you're getting millions of dollars for it but really you're pushing sugar in, in the artificial sweeteners like ugh, get the get the fuck out of here sell out you can't you don't want to be a sellout. you'll see me next week with a commercial for McDonald's <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, but I, I, something with that, with a higher purpose, I could see myself doing that eventually, that'd be cool, but anyways, guys, that, that's, that's it, that's all I got for you here, please follow my other channel, Ryback TV, that's the podcast, we have to wait 30 days, I don't know, it's probably like, like 20 something days left before we can uh, give it the custom URL, um, we already got the, you have to give out the 100 subscribers and you got to be 30 days old. And then we will get that uh, custom URL for you guys to be able to, you could find that channel much easier. I know it's not showing up for everybody. And I know it happened to me. And I'm like, well, how's anyone going to find this? But that's where the podcast is. Conversation with the big guy, Ryback, the Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report. This channel is nothing but food uh, and feeding time. And Ryback has heat from now on. Because YouTube, you have to be very specific with the content if we want them to show the videos. And otherwise, it defeats the purpose if nobody sees it. And if it's only a small, for the work and stuff putting in, you want everyone to see your content. So, <clears throat> and, uh, and then I'll do some of the other stuff on my social media accounts, I think, when I do some other videos here and there. But yeah, other than that, guys, that, Feed Me More Nutrition, feedmemore.com and Amazon. Thank you very much for watching. Feed me if you need me. Feed me more. Yo, thank you guys for watching Ryback TV. If you could check out my Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report every Monday on all podcast platforms, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback every Thursday morning on all podcast platforms, and Feed Me More Nutrition, my personal supplement line, available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Save 10% with discount code YouTube10 and save stupid. Why couldn't you? Almost had it. I almost had the whole video done in one take. <sighs> 
New customers, you can save 20% with discount code NEWCUSTOMER on feedmemore.com. Get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.